everyone welcome to noble creative tutorials today we are going to see a six scripts for adobe photoshop that will make your workflow faster and those scripts are easy to use and for free so let's get started so sometimes in your design you may um, need to change your uh, font for your project and you may end up having so many uh, ones so if you want to go one by one that a time consuming so what we're going to do and see in this script is selecting all your uh, file there and then go to file scripts and advanced fonts remapping what this does is going to give us this uh, nice dialogue here uh, box dialogue uh, telling us the current font and the desired font family that we want to choose and you can see here we have here the before and the after and layers that it's being used and arranged all the information that I need to know and here we have uh, the other fonts which one we want to change to and give us the, the examples here maybe you want to leave that as is so maybe we want to change that too so let's change it to this one and then do the magic so wait a few seconds and boom it's changed as we tell the script to change maybe we'll need to do some few tweaks uh, because each font is ha it have a different size so the, this is was the first one so and let's see the other one which is about align alignment i have here these three uh these three text here uh three words you have each word here we have photoshop ideas and uh, I may want to align it. I may use uh, guide layers that I have here, smart guide layers, but sometimes I may need uh, time or even if I want to select three of them and then just align them, it's not, they are not going to be aligned. Why? Because I create them using the box and they have uh, different, because uh, bounding box are different for each word. So we need uh, Photoshop try to align them, align them accordingly to, to the box size. So this script is very, very useful and powerful. What it do is align to the best line of those words. And if we grab the guide here, you see it's, it do what it should do. And this is what's, the second one so the third one is also about text and as we see here we have this uh, nice here uh, with effects this box text here and we want to make a columns instead of this box here if you want to create uh, columns in it you may need a separate uh, text layer but in the with this script all you need to do is go into script and then text columns and it give you how many columns you want you want three and the gather is like the spacing between each column maybe 50 pixel and change the columns and there you go it changing it and it's keep the the effect there and it's it's responsive so we may want to change the size and everything you need you, it still work with the paragraph and character size so you may need to change anything in that it stay this is a very nice uh script the other one that we're going to use is clear hiding effects what does mean is maybe in your project that may be a, a big one we have here some uh, effects layers that I am hating like this glow and, or you know you may have you want to get rid of them so instead of going one by one all you need to do is go into scripts and clear hiding effects and it's going to do the magic and tell us how many layers there and remove the effect the total so it does everything for us so no more uh, messy projects and we have another another uh, script which is uh, very useful too is deleting all the empty layer faster so for example maybe we have some like 
just uh, layers that are not used so you just go and delete all empty layers and it tells us three three layers that have been uh, removed and another one which is very powerful from all of those scripts is the end smart object we have here this smart object uh, as you see here we have this smart object and sometimes you may need to end smart that inside the the document that you are working on so instead of going back and forth there's no and smart objects on photoshop to just convert into smart objects and this script is and smart the whole smart objects and it make it as it is just to make it in a, a new folder and as you see here we have this and smart it and then you can just work fine inside your uh, projects so if you like those scripts please uh, visit the website of magic scripts and support this guy and if you like the video please like and subscribe for more videos coming soon thank you for watching